So now we're ready to connect everything together. And to start off, I need to convert the two inch PVC from my sump pump coming out of the house and go into that, that coupling, but then convert that out to my four inch corrugated. So to do that, I'm gonna start off with PVC, just a two inch schedule 40 PVC and make an elbow with two small extensions coming off each side. One will go into the rubber coupling that's going in the house. And then one will go and expand out to a four inch PVC. So now I have into four inch PVC. So I'll take a small five inch long section of four inch PVC. And now I'm ready to use the coupling that will convert from four inch PVC to four inch corrugated. Make sure you use that exact type of coupling because it has a nice lip that will hold the four inch corrugated pipe into the fitting. And then there's the finished product. So now we're ready to start getting the drain pipe laid out and then all my Y's connected up. So first up, I'm just connecting the outlet of the Y to the 36 foot run of the corrugated and then putting my downspout in place. I do wrap each of the connections with the corrugated tape, kind of similar to electrical tape, just to make sure everything's watertight. Now I do have that Y going into the downspout. That is gonna be for a clean out. So I will cap that, but I'll be able to stick a guarded hose down there if I need to flush things out. So now connecting up the sump pump, this is a live sump pump. So it is pumping out probably about every five minutes. I'll cut off the corrugated to the length I need. And then I'll try to attach this coupling. And I have a little bit of a hard time and I don't want to damage the corrugated. So what I did is I went ahead and took a heat gun. I warmed up the coupling, brought it back and then it was much easier to get into the corrugated and get that lip really attached around the ribs of the corrugated pipe. Once that was done, then I was able to tighten up the band clamp and everything now is secure. But to get this to line up with that coupling coming out of the house, I do need to move a little dirt just so I can change the angle of the corrugated pipe coming up to that adapter. So I'm just moving some dirt next to the wall of the house. And then I can shift over that corrugated and now get the adapter secured into the coupling. Now hopefully that helps you guys out and that sump pump down there with the adapter and downspout have been coming together for years and years without any issues. If you wanna see that complete project and that's gonna help you actually get the right grade and trench out that corrugated pipe, check out this video right here and you'll see the complete start to finish project to help you out with your own projects around your house. So thanks for joining me on this video and we'll catch you on that next one. Take care.